In this video, I'm going to show you how to install AutoGPT to run locally on your computer. We're going to have to install Git, Python, Visual Studio Code, get an OpenAI account for our OpenAI key and run AutoGPT from our terminal or command line. Now, first thing you want to do is go to Google and type download Git. Once you get to the Git website, go ahead and click on this button here to download for Windows or Mac. Now click on this link over here. Once your browser finishes downloading the file, just click on that file and complete the installation. Next, we're going to download Python. So go ahead and go back to Google and type download Python. Go to the first search results and here click on that yellow download Python button. Wait for the file to download, then just click on it and complete the installation. Next, we're going to download Visual Studio Code. So type download VS code, go to the first search result and on this page, choose your version of Visual Studio Code for Mac or Windows. Wait for the file to download, click on it and install VS code. Now go back to Google and type open AI sign up. Go to the open AI website, find the sign up button and create a new open AI account. I already have my open AI account and I'm signed in. So I'm just going to go to this API keys link here. This is where you're going to create your API keys. Now you can also access this page in the upper right corner here where your account is. Just go to view API keys. To create an API key, all you have to do is click on this create new secret key button. So once you've done that, go ahead and copy and paste that key somewhere. We're going to need it in the next step. Now let's go ahead and go back to Google and type download auto GPT. Now the first search result is going to be the official GitHub repository for auto GPT. And if you go there in the upper right corner here, you'll see the green code button. Now we're going to copy this project to our hard drive. So go ahead and copy this link, then go to your start button on windows and just start typing CMD, then just hit enter and you're going to open the command prompt. Now make sure you're in your C drive and type mkdir auto GPT. This will create a folder on our C drive, then use the CD command to enter that folder. Now, because we have git installed, we can now use the git command. So just type git clone and paste that URL that you copied from AutoGPT GitHub page, then hit enter and that will copy AutoGPT to your hard drive. Now, because you have VS code installed, you can now use the code command. So type code and dot and hit enter. This will open AutoGPT in your VS code editor. Now here you have all kinds of different files. The only ones we need from here are env.template that looks like this. This is where we're going to enter our open AI key, but also requirements.txt file. So go back to your command line or terminal if you're on a Mac and type pip, which is Python's package installer, install dash r requirements.txt then hit enter. And if you get this error, basically it means that you also need to CD into auto dash GPT folder because that's where the git clone command actually cloned it. Now run this pip install command with the requirements that text file here, just hit enter and just wait for all of the Python modules required by auto GPT to be installed. Now go back to your VS code project. So go ahead and find that env.template file on the list here. The first thing you want to do is right click on the file and go to rename, just remove that template part and hit enter. Now browse down to this part in this file that says open AI API key. Take your API key and copy and paste it there. Just make sure to use double quotes around the key. So here I'm going to paste it and make sure to wrap it in double quotes. Don't forget to save the file and go back to your command line and type Python dash M auto GPT and hit enter. 